As a council, we've been interested in um, building new social housing for quite a long time. The properties that we have here are all built to passive house standards, so that's really lowered the energy bills. Houses have to be very highly insulated and airtight. Really simple things like you can't have a letterbox in the front door, so we've had to kind of, you know, find places for the letterboxes. But more significant than that, it's a fabulous place for people to live. So even if you're in a single flat, you've got a little balcony. If you're a family, you've got a little bit of outdoor space. But there's communal space as well. For me, one of the most successful aspects are the social issues. We were very keen to ensure that front doors face front doors. So something like a traditional street is very good for that. To make it less car orientated so there's many more places for people just to walk or children to scoot without having to cross a road. We've carved out these play spaces which all the residents can have access to so the children can play securely, um, overlooked by their parents. So there's a kind of social aspect to the scheme that I think is really successful. When people walk in and they're kind of impressed as if you built this, you know, I didn't choose the brickwork or the front door or, you know, but it's clear that someone has and someone did care that I liked my home and that means a lot to me. That someone put the effort to say, let's try something different and it doesn't feel like I rent a house, I feel like I own a house, which is really nice. <laughs>